I'm here with Anya McCormick from Shannon. Very welcome to sunny Sydney. Obviously, it's an absolute pleasure to be here. Um, how long have you been in Sydney yourself? Just arrived this morning after travelling for 36 hours, so we said we'd hang around here for another couple of hours and meet the girls as they arrive in from Brisbane. And have another couple of coffees, I'd say. The jet lag is hitting. The jet lag is hitting, but we'll get over that because we're buzzing. That's it. Oh, there's, a, there's a great buzz around the place. A lot of excitement, obviously, at home and here. Uh, what would be your message to the team if you could step into the dressing room and give them a bit of support before the game? Most importantly, if they go out and enjoy it, they'll be able to express themselves and they'll do what we all know that they can do. I, I am very confident that we'll come out of our group. What makes you so sure that Ireland are going to get out of the group? We have to believe. We have the, we have the out-believed ha hashtag, but you have to believe. And I think playing Australia in the first game is the best time to get them. I think we'll get a draw out of that. Hopefully a draw against Canada and hopefully beat Nigeria. I've seen a lot of the Australian media are kind of painting this picture that Ireland are going to be a very rough team, maybe a few agricultural tackles, you know yourself. We've got a lot of quality in the squad. How do you think they're going to play? What, what do you think the game plan is? Probably will be quite defensive, but as Vera Pau said the other day, we had the least number of fouls in the campaign to get us here. So while people might think that there's a bit of fouling or kicking or whatnot going on, it's not. We're physical, but within the laws of the game. And I think we'll be like that again against Australia. And finally, for all the people watching at home, you know, we really want to get a, a big buzz in the country, get the, the whole nation behind the girls. What would you say to the fans at home to get them g up for the game? Got to get out, got to get watching the game, get as many parties going, watch parties with kids, boys and girls, get them all involved and get a bit of fun, get some bunting up and have a bit of fun with it. Get stuck in, Vera's army. Vera's army, let's go. Come on, come on. Thanks very much.